especially it's a lot of fun with the kids. You know, giving back, just those are the people who appreciate, appreciate you the most. You know, you got little kids looking up to you who, you know, they idolize you. You know, so you always want to go back, give back, uh, help out any way possible. You know, and I was told about it. You know, um, at first I didn't know if I could do it because of my schedule, right. but. As soon as I looked at it and found out, you know, I was quick to jump at it, and you know, it's always good to get back, especially coming back to Kentucky, you know, the place uh, I definitely miss a lot. Pat, going on a month and a half as a pro, how's it been? Uh, pretty much a roller coaster ride. Um, just flying from point A to point B, you know, constantly you know, traveling, basketball, summer league, and the summer was a lot of fun in Vegas. Um, trying to settle down in Houston and pretty much just, just get everything situated before we have to return back to uh, the game. Um, Preseason work done. Give something you know, to, the, to the guys who are here. Do you want to play with the guys? The guys who are coming in, Kentucky the freshmen, give them some, some pointers. That's what you want to I wouldn't mind to. You know, um, I had the privilege to play um, against them not too long ago. So uh, that was definitely a fun time. I enjoyed being on the court with them and you know, just seeing what the new guys are capable of. So you know, I definitely wouldn't mind coming back in the future and you know, just playing alongside Kentucky people. It's a big thing I you know Carolina does every summer. Their guys come back, and you know, got a lot of NBA guys come back and play against their current guys. Do you think some of you guys might do that over the years? Oh, well, definitely. I know Coach Cal will do whatever is um, possible, whatever is in his power to just do. You know, and I know me, John, um, Marcus, Eric, and so forth. I definitely want to come back and you know do whatever is necessary. We you impressed. Of guys? Great guys, uh, definitely impressive. Uh, very talented, and also just like last year's group, mature for their age. So from what I've seen on the court, off the court, whenever I'm around them, you know, they always do the right thing. And on the court, you know, they're, they're very talented. So I definitely look forward to I'll seeing, see you know, how fast they gel together and uh, how well they perform on the court. How are you adjusted to Houston? Great. You know, I love Houston. Um, it's a big city, a lot of stuff to do, a lot of great people, friendly people, um, eager and willing to help you out. So uh, settle down, finally got a place, move in August 4th, and then, Know, just, just trying to get used to the area, to the streets, to, uh, to the city, to everything that's surrounding, to the fans, and you know, to just want to get out and um, you know, just get my face out there, and just show the people that I'm here, and um, you know, willing to do whatever's necessary for the city. Did you get a house or did you rent or apartment? Oh, or what, what are you doing? Uh, it's all house, you know, three bedroom, uh, three bathroom, you know, just something close to the arena, so uh, I can get back and forth to practice um, and just get used to the area, used to the city before I actually branch out and. You know, move into like a big house. Too. Have you splurged on anything yet? No, not yet. I'm um, still looking around, but you know, there's a lot of great areas, um, a lot of great food, a uh, great place to be. You know, so I'm definitely trying to find the right place to where I can go. You know, every single day. Did you get Buster that RV? Not yet. You know, he's still picking up an RV from a catalog right now. You know, I think he probably has one in mind, but uh, I'm thankful that's the only thing they want. You know, it's an RV. You know, so they won't be digging in my pockets. <laughs> Pretty much just try to better myself every single day. You know, the thing about college was you had people um, asking me constantly if you want to get extra work in. Um, you know, I'm here for you if you need anything. Or, you know, sometimes they put forth the effort before you do. You know, rather at the NBA level, you have to go to them. You know, uh, they expect you to do something. You know, if you don't do it, that's on you. You know, so um, really, just the next level is all about being your own man. Uh, it's definitely a business, like everyone says. And, you have to strive and have that determination to be the best you can be and constantly do the right thing.